<laughs> All right, let's get excited. We know what that music means. Yeah. We're gearing up for Rodeo Houston. The entertainment lineup is now officially official. Officially, if it finally <laughs> came out. Uh, as promised, it's around 7 in the evening yesterday. We got a mix of genres once again, country, rap music. I mean, heck, even Nickelback. Uh, back with us again, Danielle Grossman. Uh, good morning. Thanks for getting up early uh, two days in a row. I appreciate it. It's all, it's all right, guys. Did you think the lineup was everything you thought of? Did you guess any? I, you know, I did I, guess I, a few. Did you? Yes. I was not surprised about Zach Brown okay. and Luke Bryan. I kind of thought maybe we would be lucky enough to have him back. I was pretty surprised, but, but pleasantly so. Yeah. Um, what did you think? I mean, well, you knew already, so <laughs> this is but the first time you're yeah, allowed to tell us. I mean, honestly, I was surprised how excited people got over Nickelback. Um, <laughs> I am excited for that show, too, but... At, Overall, I think everyone's really excited about the variety of it and the diversity, which is something that we really strive for this year. So that's also awesome. And of course, some of these artists that are like up and coming that are still trying to make a name for themselves. I think that's going to be great for them. And it's going to also be a good show for everyone else. So it's like, you know, those concerts that you're like, I'll never buy a ticket to if they actually go on tour. But this is the chance to like see them right. at the rodeo. So yeah. it's going to be great. And you know what else, Danielle, if folks have not gone to the social media of Rodeo Houston and checked out that video. You said that some of the younger uh, crew members from Rodeo Houston were able to put that together. That was so amazing. Stellar. That was creative. Yeah. Wasn't it so cool? They really tried to use all of the iconic places in Houston and just make it a really fun, interactive way to reveal the artist. And they did a superb job. The reveal in the stadium itself was also unbelievable. It felt like a mini concert. It was amazing. And I think the response was also great. People are just excited. Some people even said they were surprised. Excuse me, I'm losing my voice from last night because I talked too much clearly. Um, <clears throat> that some of these people are still together and in bands. So it's an exciting time and it's it's new. You know, having 10 new artists is something that's very rare. So yeah. I think people should get excited and get ready to buy those tickets next week. All right, we want to let you rest your voice, but one more question. When do the tickets go on <laughs> yeah. sale? Remind everybody about all that good stuff. Yes, tickets go on sale Thursday the 18th in two waves. So those first 10 artists, they're going to go on sale at 10 a.m., the second 10 artists at 2 p.m. So get ready, make your lineup, get in those waiting rooms and get your tickets. They start at 25 bucks. Let's do it. All right, Danielle, thank you so much for joining us again. We'll see you soon, I'm sure. Yes, bye, guys. Bye. See you soon. Now, to see the full lineup, in case you missed it in the dates for all the performers, click to Houston.com right there on the homepage.